Well, Disney has its fair share of fabulous villains, but they typically don't get the spotlight. But the latest production at the Civic Theater, all about the bad guys, girls, and kids from so many of your favorite movies. It's Descendants, the musical, and today we have a preview. We've got Mickey Robinson. She plays Mal in the production, and Eric is the director. The first time yes. he's directed a full performance yes. at Civic. Thanks. Thank you both so much for being here. Thank you for having us. Absolutely. So, Mickey, tell us a little bit about the story for those who aren't familiar. Well, okay. Descendants tells us story of four evil kids. Um, we got the son of Jafar, the son of Cruella de Vil, the daughter of Grimhilda, the evil queen, and the daughter of Maleficent, who I'm playing. Um, these four kids get the chance to go live in Oridon, the land of the good kids, which is super exciting. Um, they start off with some not so great intentions, but soon they find their selves, they find who they really want to be, decide that they don't want to follow in their parents' footsteps. And it's an entire show of high energy, plot twists, exciting stories. It's a blast. Yeah. Fun for all ages. Absolutely. Yeah. And Eric, talk a little bit about um, the cast and, and what it's like for you being a first time director with us. Oh, it's been incredibly exciting. We have a cast of uh, 26, uh, ranging ages from 13 to 69. Uh, so a, a wide breadth of the human experience. There's stuff uh, added little Easter eggs for fans of the Disney movies throughout the 90s and 2000s, 80s, and all that stuff. There's a, a, a lot for, for all ages and uh, explorations of chosen family, and it's, it's a great time. Yeah, and, and you talk about you know, some of the Easter eggs and, and throwing it back because there are some stories that you know, us older people will really relate to absolutely. that aren't necessarily the new shows that everybody knows, right? Yeah, absolutely. And it pulls, you know, from movies like Aladdin, and, you know, we have uh, one of our characters is like, we're theming to like the son of Hercules and like little Easter eggs and stuff like that. It's, it's incredible. Okay, perfect. And so tell us a little bit about what, what you love about playing Mal. Oh my goodness. Well, Mal has a pretty big character arc. <laughs> she <laughs> wants to follow in her mother's footsteps. She wants to prove herself. But throughout the show, she meets a little guy named Ben, the son of um, Belle and Beast. If you saw Beauty and the Beast, that's kind of fun. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully, right? right? <laughs> um, so she, they kind of meet, they fall in love a little bit. It's a little bit of a spell, you know. Oh, yeah, <laughs> right? Those, that's Disney, those powers. Those Disney moments. <laughs> love um, it. And you know, this changes her mindset. She gets to go fall in love, um, decide she does a little thing at the end. I almost spoiled the entire show. You have to come see it to <laughs> okay. know that. No spoilers today. <laughs> um, yeah, but Mal is such a fun role to play. She just has so much emotion. She has so much character. She's high energy. She has great people behind her, and it's yeah. honestly so fun. I love it. Lots of, lots of singing, lots of dancing. Absolutely. And, and talk about the challenges of directing a show with ages 13 to 69. That is a wide range of, of characters and people and personalities. <laughs> it is, it, you know, there's, there's certain challenges that come inherently with that, but the cast is so hardworking and so energetic and so fun and so professional. Like the maturity level of all the, the teenagers throughout all of the adults has just been stellar. Um, and it's made the process incredibly easy and incredibly smooth. The talent is just explosive. Um, so lots to see lots of singing, lots of dancing, lots of cartwheels. Oh. Uh, yeah, flips. Okay. Come oh my see it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Who knew gymnastics too? <laughs> yeah. Right. Okay. Perfect. All right. So let's go for the details yes. of the show. When is it and when? How can people get tickets? March 1st through 17th. You can get tickets at grct.org slash descendants. Uh, performances are at 7.30 p.m. Wednesday through Saturday. Sunday 2 p.m. matinees as well as some Saturday 2 p.m. matinees. And we also have uh, the opportunity for some low sensory performances as well yes. on uh, Tuesday, March 12th, which is an uh, opportunity we're very excited about as that, well. That's wonderful to offer that. Yeah. To, to, to audiences of all abilities and interests. And all right, Mickey, you guys, you brought some of your friends along. Absolutely. And so tell us, you're going to do a little, a little performance for us. So just describe this scene for us. All right, so we're doing Good is the New Bad. This is almost immediately after the um, four villain kids get introduced to Ordon. This is their first time in the land of glory. <laughs> and they are having a blast just running around, making some mischief. Um, high energy, it's super fun. All right, perfect. Thank you both so much, Thank Eric. You. Good luck. Break legs, right? Thank yes. you. <laughs> um, again, the details of the show, March 1st through 17th. You want tickets, grct.org. All right, take it away, guys. We were bad, now we're good. Guess we just misunderstood. We'll be good, never bad. We're the best you ever had. We know what's hot, what's not. We strike a pose and then you take a shot. Your minds are closed, you try to run the spot. We came to show you what we got, we got. It's time to take a stand. 
We're breaking through and now we're in command. We're on a mission, we can't shout out loud. So keep your cool and still be in your crowd. That was all the rage last week, but good has got a wicked beat. Good is the new bad, good is the true bad. Got the whole world backwards. Check out these whack nerds. Bad is the new good, bad is the true good. Spin the whole world backwards. I think that we should. We were bad, now we're good, cause we just misunderstood. Bad is good, good is bad, we're the best you ever had.